The trickiest thing about what we do for a living is communicating the crazy creative vision that exists to everybody who's not sharing your same brain. When it all comes together in the end and you start to see these images, you know, develop into the ultimate like deliverable, it's, it's amazing. My name is Matt Thomas. I'm the director and director of photography for Upper Valley Film Co. I ended up at St. Francis because uh, I was looking to get into the arts as a career. I was playing soccer and I got a scholarship at the time. All through high school, I was super into photography. I lived in the dark room and always found a passion in that side of the art industry. When it came time to figure out what I wanted to do for a living, I started talking to people and sort of fell into this graphic design path where I thought, this is where creative exists, this is gonna be fun, let's chase this and go get a job at an advertising agency. Fast forward to my senior year of university and I'm looking around like, I hate this. <laughs> this is not what I want to do at all. You know, I was still doing photography all along my time during school. That was still where my passion lied. It took me until my senior year when I had a class in commercial photo and realized, oh wow, I can do this for a living. This is what I've always wanted to do for a living. It's time to give it 110%. What I liked most about San Francis was that it was kind of a blank slate for the experience that you wanted to have. You go to a big state school and it kind of is what it's going to be. But at St. Francis, I had like insane flexibility to kind of make the experience what I wanted to be. You know, art school is hard enough as it is. You know, choosing that as a career is hard enough as it is. Going there for four years and trying to get good grades and trying to balance that with like an athlete schedule and all that sort of thing, like it teaches you really fast how hard you need to work to make a dream a reality. I would tell anybody who's, you know, 18 years old, senior in high school, thinking about what the future looks like, trust yourself. There's a million people in your life who are gonna be telling you to do one thing, try another, but the most motivating voice for you is going to be you. I wish I could tell the 18 year old version of myself to go all in on what you were passionate about because ultimately that's what worked out for me.